All right, thanks, Don. Finally over, the Virginia Beach City School Board meeting went very late into the night, a contentious meeting at points as members fought amongst each other. At issue, whether or not a closed-door meeting in August was legal or not. Tenor News Science Jason Marks has been following this story, which involves a superintendent and a couple of board members. Jason? Yeah, absolutely. You, you mentioned it. It went two hours, this meeting, and at times they were discussing it and at times they were arguing whether this closed door meeting by the superintendent who filed uh, some complaints against some of the fellow school board members was legal or illegal. Now let's show you some video from the meeting. As you mentioned, this meeting happening a couple months ago, they met behind closed doors. Virginia Beach Superintendent Dr. Aaron Spence was upset because he felt as if he was being poorly treated by some of the other board members, making it difficult for him to do his job. He asked that the board do it behind closed doors because he said he didn't want to do it out there in public. He wanted to be behind closed doors, didn't want to draw attention to it. He said he was upset over two Facebook posts that he called demeaning that were posted by board member Vicki Manning. After the meeting, Manning, along with Laura Hughes and Carolyn Weems, hired an attorney who sent a letter to the school system saying the meeting behind closed doors was illegal and it violated the Freedom of Information Act. They say Spence wasn't considered an employee and thus he's not entitled to have a hearing behind closed doors. The attorney who represents the school system disagreed and said it was legal. For two hours, not only did they talk about this, but they also aired out other issues they had with each other. Some members admit the board appeared dysfunctional and they hope this is a step to move on. Well, I hope the efforts that the board made tonight to reach some consensus on some pretty challenging issues is a good first step towards creating a, a really functional and, and committed board. Well, we all need to remember why we're here. We all need to understand that as adults, you can agree to disagree. You can compromise. You, you, you can't have anybody in the room who's just unwilling to bend at all. And the board members agree that they need to revisit how they handle the superintendent when he has complaints about fellow board members. He needs to go to someone to be able to go ahead and complain about his bosses. The question is, is it, will ha is it going to happen behind closed doors or does it have to happen in the open? That is yet to be seen. That's the latest here in Virginia Beach. Jason Marks, 10 on your side.